Yeah, we do this one. We do the movie star thing. But we cannot use this truck, though. We're gonna recover you. And we're gonna park you outside here instead. In case we need you. And we're gonna take that truck. Because that one has the low saddle. We're taking this one. And now then we need to go all the way up here. No, that's where we need to deliver it. Where is the movie? Ooh. Do we need... Have we unlocked so we can get to the other side? <gasps> awesome. We're going to go to the other, um, other map now. The thing I like with the uh, Way of the Hunter is that if you want to do long-range shooting... You need to use a caliber uh, that is higher than is um, meant for the animal you want to shoot because it drops in speed and uh, or veloci velocity and uh, impact power the longer away the animal is. So the, a bullet that is meant for uh, something big might be perfect to hit something small with in a long distance. And you need to calculate that and also, you need to take care of the herds and make sure they get uh, keep the good animals alive so they can breed more and better animals. Yeah, I do really like it. I did enjoy it. It was quite a while since I played this game, just so you guys know. Uh, we want to go there. Can we go past there? It kind of looks like there is an accident over here. Yeah, I think if we go this way... It's going to be harder to take that turn with the trailer, though. I play quite. A, I did, or I did play quite a lot of Escape from Tarkov. Also, that is a game I love, but I don't like playing it solo either. And right now, I have uh, my friends that I was playing it with. They don't really play games or play it anymore that much, so <laughs> I don't have anyone to play it with. Holy shit! That is a huge, huge trailer. So now we're unlocked by the lake. The new area. We should get the scout truck over here though, because we're gonna need to unlock some uh, towers. Everything is dark here. Right? Yeah, there's one lookout tower there. Ridge Mountain. Mountain Ridge. Oh, so there's only one lookout tower on the whole area. Holy shit, okay. Wow, we can do this. Yeah, Tarkov is awesome, yeah. I, I, I do suck at it, though. I'm not good at all. I'm technically not good at any game, really. But I enjoy playing them anyway. So you will most likely see a, a shitload of fuck-ups where I just fail <laughs> technically and it's okay to laugh at it if i fuck up and you l think it's funny that's worth it <laughs> welcome to the club well it is a hard game it is a really really hard game it takes such a long time to get in and learn the, all the mechanics in that game there's so much of it Right now we're driving around in Scandinavia though, so it's really cool, because uh, me myself is from Scandinavia, I'm from Sweden. Since I play this game a lot, they've released five more regions that I have not really played. So I have uh, fallen behind quite a lot on this game. 
There's been too many other good games coming out. When this game was released, dude, I played it every day for so long. It was so fun. But it was more fun in the beginning, though, before I got all the good tracks, when it was actually harder. Then it was way more fun. Now I have so good trucks that I rarely get stuck anymore. Or I do, do get stuck, but I don't get stuck stuck. I can always get loose from them. It's not like from the beginning where I had to bring trucks to take my other trucks out all the time. Yeah, you do that. Uh, so there are three games. It is Mud Runner. It's the first one. It's old. And then there is this one. Snow Runner. And then it is the newest one, which is called Mud Runner Expedition. But Expedition is a completely different game compared to Mud Runner and Snow Runner. Because that you focus on um, on uh, scout trucks and exploration rather than uh, doing jobs. We're gonna transport this for a uh, movie star, apparently. I wonder which movie star. Oh, look at that. Almost perfect. Flip. <laughs> See, I can I can do stuff sometimes. Let's go over the right road here. Gonna be a bumpy ride. Or if you have any uh, sensitive stuff in there, you can easily break. Not my fault. You hired me. With my track record, you should know. Of the new one, I had a feeling it was gonna be more uh, based on uh, based on exploration rather than doing a yeah. That's why I had really haven't really gotten it yet because I did enjoy the work part in uh, both No Runner and Mud Runner, and it has also gotten very bad reviews. Although I usually don't look at reviews, I want to make my own opinion. But um, I'm probably gonna buy it when it's on sale next time and try it out. Like uh, Call of the Wild in this game, I bought every freaking DLC for the game, season, year pass, everything. Same with uh, the Hunter Call of the Wild. I bought every map and everything. This is a good game. I wanted to support them and I play a lot. So why not support them and buy all their DLCs so they can continue making it. Now we're gonna go back to the original uh, map on this region. Damn, this was heavy. It's not going fast at all. Come on, hurry up. They rely on solar energy at least. That's good. Good for the environment. And then we look at a truck that is transporting it, just spitting out black smoke all the time. <laughs> well, parts is good for the environment at least. Boom, 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 boom. Where are we going in? 35 kilometers an hour. No, 30 kilometers an hour. Woo! It's not going fast, but it's going forward. The game froze. There we go. Thank you. Travel to the other area. We can skip that now. Okay, where do we need to take this one out? I guess we need to go back over on this side. Because we need to get up there. And there is no good way to get over unless that way, maybe. But I haven't been up there. And that road is broken over there. 
which means we would have to take that road. Which probably will be more chaotic. I think it's better if we try to squeeze in between here and go back this side. Because that one, broken road there, it's easy to get over. Uh, over there, I don't really know. Don't remember. But it's probably going to be somewhat easy. We, go, we do it. We can do it. Just need to manage to take this corner over here. Damn, this was a heavy trailer. Is the movie star inside of it? Dude, we will never be able to take this corner. We're gonna hit the signs. Worth it though. It's fine. It's gonna be fine. It was a little bit laggy today. I don't really know why. It's gonna be fine. It is when you played it quite a long time when you start taking, trying to take shortcuts to make the, the uh, jobs faster where shit goes haywire and you end up losing time rather than saving time oh. why am I stuck at? Dude, I cannot reverse. I cannot go forward. What are we stuck at? Oh, look at that. It wenched underneath my trailer. Are you shitting me? We fucked up the tires there. We cannot go forward or backward. It's just stuck. All right. Come on, pull it loose. Come on, break you fucking thingy. Well, that ain't gonna work. Whoop. We need to get it loose. Somehow. You see the tire is completely wenched inside of it. Just making it worse and worse here. Holy shit. No, oh, where have we went? Winch. 
The trailer is the only thing keeping us up right now. Holy shit. <laughs> this is not going well. Um, oh, we can't reach that one. Oh, that sucks. Uh, can this one reach anywhere? No. We can't reach anything. Uh... Yeah. Okay, now then. No. Nope. And it got worse. I have no idea how we're gonna fix this. Go. How are we gonna get that thing loose from our tires? What happens if we detach it? Yeah, that thing is stuck there for good, man. That thing is on there good. Did we get it off? Yes, we got loose. Ah. Uh -huh. Screw the one who's give the, who's giving up, man. Look at that. We got loose. Perfect. He jammed stuck underneath the fucking trailer. Holy shit. But we got it. That's the important part. It is freaking doable. Yeah, okay. Apparently it's okay over there. It sounds like this yeah, the wheels are spinning though. I think it's a flat tire on it now though. If the trailers can get a flat tire, I don't remember. They might be able to. We're gonna survive at least. We're gonna make the delivery. They will need to um, clean the trailer though. Because everything is basically upside down in it now. Thrown everywhere. Nothing is in place anymore. All the plates and everything is probably broken. It's not my fault they wanted to be moved immediately after a freaking uh, natural catastrophe or whatever you call it, however you pronounce it. Wait, we're going the wrong way. That is absolutely not my fault. I did what I could to save it. We're going in here. Oh, 
I like when the camera angle do do that. Oh, look at that. Northern Lights. Look, Ben. Oh, it's beautiful. Fuck your camera. Is there someone in there? The lights are on inside the trailer. I hope no one is in there. I might have murdered someone. There we go. Comfort come first. Apparently, it's better than safety. Now we can start getting the set ready. But I really want to make a movie in this area. Well, 